Hey guys, General Jobber here, and we've just had a tease for DLC 3 for Black Ops 3. Just like we had a trailer surrounding Nikolai, we finally have one for Richtofen. I can't put the whole video in here because of copyright, but I can explain to you what Richtofen says. In the tease, Richtofen's talking about how much he's gone through in order to keep his promises to him and to keep him safe. He then goes on to speak about all of the bad things that he's done to keep his vow. All of this is shown over images of uh, the giant and Richtofen sitting in the forest in the lone screen of Black Ops 3 zombies. He also mentions how none of it really matters in this moment, this me. Uh, and finally, he speaks about how he thinks Richtofen doesn't know, but he does. But the most interesting thing about this tease uh, is his actual final words in the trailer. When we get a mid-shot of his face, he simply says, The blood will protect me. So what can we gather from this tease? Well, I was working on a video in which I discussed my thoughts and ideas for DLC 3 and 4, and this tease that Trialk have just released further confirms some of the things I actually say in that. Uh, we now know that Richtofen's insurance policy that he mentions at the end of the Zetsubu no Shima easter egg is actually these vials of blood that he's been collecting from the prisoners in Mob of the Dead and the previous versions of themselves that they've been going through time killing. However, the second most interesting thing from this trailer is the fact that Richtofen knows that someone he's trying to protect is trying to do something against him, which is why he's speaking about when he says uh, that he thinks that he doesn't know but he actually does. And we can only assume that this vow that he's made with him is the vow he made with Dr. Maxis and his vow to secure a better tomorrow for the children. However, we don't get all of the information we need from this tease to piece all of the story together. This tease is all about these blood vials, that's the center of this memories trailer. Uh, these are the blood vials that are found on the characters from Origins and Zetsubu no Shima. And with the release of this trailer, we can assume that reasonably soon we will see why we have them and why the characters are, you know, keeping them. Uh, then we already know that these vials are necessary for Richtofen's plans and now we're finally seeing it all fall in his place. He keeps expressing in the tease that he's only trying to do the right thing. The final question that I still have is why Richtofen is the only one without his own blood vial. Why does he have blood blood from the prisoners in Mob of the Dead while Dempsey, Nikolai and Takio all have their own once you complete the Zetsubu no Shima Easter egg and you look on the character models, although we can only assume that's their own considering we don't have any names written on them whereas Richtofen's have the prisoner numbers and the cell numbers written on them. We know that everyone's soul is inside the summoning key, we also have the four people you sacrifice in Shadows of Evil, the lawyer and those kind of people, I can't remember like entirely who they are but we also know that they are in the summoning key as well alongside uh, Takio, Dempsey, and Nikol uh, Richtofen, sorry, we're, we're about to get Nikolai. But why doesn't he have his own blood is still a big question. If everyone's got their own blood and they've got their own souls in the summoning key, why have we only got Richtofen's soul and not his blood? But I guess all will be revealed in DLC 3. Yet yeah, another epic trailer from Triarch, and if you like this video, please consider subscribing. Thanks for watching. I've been General Drabble, and goodbye.